Well, it's, it's, it's a pleasure to, um, uh, to see you, and I guess this is an important day for Greece, an important day for, uh, for Amazon. We're very, very happy that uh, you know, we'll be making important announcements regarding your, yeah, your presence uh, in Greece. Uh, I think the one thing which I would like to point out is that uh, the country is changing dramatically. It's really becoming a hub for um, high-tech investments, um, uh, especially uh, in data centers, and it is very encouraging for us that uh, very, very important global players um, uh, choose uh, uh, Greece to establish a, a permanent uh, presence. I think it's another vote of confidence in the prospects of the Greek economy. Uh, as you know, we've engaged uh, uh, in a dramatic digitization effort uh, uh, of the state. We have a cloud-first um, a policy, and we do intend uh, to establish Greece as a, as a data infrastructure uh, center. Uh, the government is fully aligned to support uh, this vision, uh, and I'm very, very happy that uh, you are uh, responding uh, and that you will uh, significantly increase your, your, footprint, your footprint in, uh, in Greece. So a pleasure to be able to, to talk with you uh, and so you can tell us a little bit more about your thoughts, yeah. your ideas, uh, and your, your plans uh, uh, about the country. No, uh, we're, the, yeah, we're very, I mean, we're very, very happy. I'm very happy about the level of, uh, of cooperation. Uh, you know, I was, I was kept informed about the progress um, that, uh, uh, that was made, but you know, maybe it's an opportunity for you to describe in a little bit more detail exactly. And for those, of you, for those who do not necessarily know what exactly you will be doing, to, to talk sure. in a little bit more detail about your plans. Sure. So, let me add to two concluding um, uh, remarks which I think are, are important. First of all, to pick up, um, to build up on what you uh, said uh, regarding the, the opportunity that the COVID tragedy is offering us um, uh, to accelerate the digitization process. Uh, this is happening uh, in Greece uh, as we speak. We have uh, you know, a state-of-the-art uh, you know, vaccination operation that was uh, um, uh, fully, uh, fully digital. Uh, we've been rolling out systematically services for businesses and citizens um, uh, through our gov.gr site. And if you ask the average Greek citizen what is the most successful thing that this government has done, they will probably tell you it is a digital uh, transformation. So we were laggards, and I think we're becoming leaders. Uh, we are really, I think, leapfrogging other countries. Uh, when it comes to transforming the fabric of the state and the way companies and citizens uh, uh, interact with the Greek um, the government. And of course, this is offering lots of opportunities. We're opening up you know, uh, our, our data sets. Um, uh, we are being extremely proactive um, uh, when it comes to uh, our policies in this uh, space. The second thing I think you, sh you need to be aware of as you, you will be, I mean, you already have a presence, but the presence is gonna be much more significant, is that uh, Greece now has a booming um, uh, tech ecosystem. Uh, we probably have four or five unicorns already uh, in, in Greece. There's tremendous interest for startup and growth capital uh, in the tech sector. Uh, and uh, the real reason behind that, I think, has to do with our human capital. Uh, we have tremendously talented uh, um, um, uh, graduates uh, from our main, uh, you know, polytechnic universities. We have an expat, uh, you know, global community of people who left the country during the crisis who would love to come back um, uh, to Greece to support uh, this Greek uh, transformation. And this is, uh, this has resulted in uh, very, very, you know, creative work done. Uh, in the Greek, uh, you know, uh, technology um, uh, space, which is clearly not directed just at the Greek markets. Uh, but these companies are are looking at the, at the global market. They just happen to be based in Greece, uh, and we're very very happy about that. So as you, uh, as you look, you know, as you scan the globe for uh, for opportunities that go beyond your your core um, uh, business, you know, keep in mind uh, uh, that. Uh, What's happening in Greece uh, is uh, very, very uh, intriguing, and I think very rewarding for, for, for all of us who've been working hard for this moment to come. I was in venture capital before I entered politics, uh, so I'm very, very happy that uh, with, the, with, with a slight delay, what I thought could be possible in Greece uh, in terms of the technology and innovation uh, uh, sector contributing a significant percentage of our GDP is, is actually happening. And of course, with COVID, Lots of people choose to work from Greece. So uh, what's, right. what's, what's interesting is that you know, in, in a more fluid and mobile work environment, 
uh, we will make it very easy for digital nomads to obtain visas. So you can work from anywhere. Um, you know, if you have good connectivity, why not work from a, from a, from a place? I mean, you work from, from a lovely place uh, in, 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 <laughs> in, in, in Montana. Uh, maybe we can entice you to spend some of your time, split your time between um, Montana and, uh, and Greece. But I can tell you, this is, this is really, this is, it's, it, it is really happening. And of course, there are many, many additional benefits for uh, in terms of economic um, um, activity across the board when people decide to spend some of our time and do business out of Greece. So not just look at Greece as a holiday destination, yeah. but as, as, a, as, as, a, as a great place to do business from. Next step. Well, thank you. Thank you very much again. And uh, I uh, will just repeat what the minister, what Minister Georgiadis said to the team. I mean, they know that we're here to help solve whatever problems um, uh, uh, you know, will present themselves. Um, uh, you know, inevitably, there are always issues that need to be addressed, but we are um, very open and very uh, uh, hands-on. Uh, uh, and who knows, uh, you, know, uh, uh, you know, I had a chance to meet uh, Jeff Bezos when he came to, to Greece during the summer. Right. Um, maybe we can also convince him to do something in the space um, uh, uh, sector uh, in, uh, in Greece. That would be another fascinating next step. But uh, thank you. Thank you very much. Looking forward to uh, welcoming you. Um, uh, you know, uh, Greece is, uh, has uh, welcome, welcomed last year a record number of American tourists. Um, uh, so maybe you can spend some time during your next trip in Europe and Greece. We'll be happy to chat in person.